Here in Miami, Lone Depot Park. MLB The Show with a good one coming at you. It's the Cincinnati Reds taking on the Miami Marlins. Ladies and gentlemen, your All right, Miami we'll be back to get this one started after Marlins. this. Two outs, space is empty. Next for Cincinnati, Steve Santa Rogers. Coach, the shortstop. Steve Rogers. First pitch, oh, just down. misses. No score, just getting started, top of the first. Now a screamer down, into the down, outfield. Down. And that one hops the wall. And that's a hey, two out double. And that keeps his hitting streak going. He's making that's this look way easier than it is, Book. Setting no the way. record is hard at all, Joe. but to keep upping it every day like he is, I don't really know what to say anymore. At this point, it honestly feels like it's never going to end. Absolutely remarkable. Well, they're looking to get on the board first here after that clutch two-out double made this inning interesting. Now here's Nolan Jones. This guy's seen two change-ups in a row. Could be a little vulnerable for a fastball right here. Hey, come on, baby. See it. Chases the change-up in the dirt. In time, the 2-3 strikeout ends the inning. I think the key is arm action on the changeup. When you can sell it like a fastball, you drop the velocity, you get the swing and mess, and you walk off the field. Ronnie Mauricio now. You talk about elite defensive players, especially in the middle of the diamond, and this guy is at the top of the list. Runner leads away at second. Out to short. Sends it to Tolia. One gone, bottom half of the first. Good fade and sinking action of that changeup. Got that hitter to roll over. The left fielder, Elijah Knight. Vladimir Rodriguez, the hey, next to hit. Rodriguez hitting better against right-handers this year, so some reverse splits there. Next pitch has popped up. You, you, you. Rogers makes the catch, and that'll do it. Marlins leave one, scoreless after one. Back here in Miami, here's C.J. Abrams to hit. Leading off for the Marlins, the designated hitter, C.J. Abrams. 1-1 one, one now. Tapped on the ground softly to short. Rogers collects on the run throw to first not in time he legs it out did a nice job getting there good throw exactly. but very Looks difficult to get anybody Christian. on that one as far as you had to go and throw you know yeah no question one gone runner at first and ready to hit now for Cincinnati now Steve the Rogers we talk about guys with good speed, and definitely he has it. But pushing the offense aside for just a second, Chris, it's the defensive side that I think the speed factors in the most. Next pitch has popped up. Kirilov gets under it. Makes the grab. Two down. Up next for Cincinnati, the third baseman, Nolan Jones. Bottom four, here's the center fielder, Christian Franklin. Leading up for the Marlins, the center fielder, Christian Franklin. Next pitch has popped up. Rogers makes the catch, and there's one away. Up next for the Marlins, the catcher, Alejandro. In now for the Reds, Steve Rogers. He's not going to get now cheated batting. up there. No, he's not. Steve. He's looking to do damage with every Roger. swing he takes. See you driving like you can. Let's go. 
And that one fouled off. Part of the order coming through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. Next pitch has popped up. Castillo moving under it. One down. Now batting. One down. And the batter will be the shortstop. Steve Rogers for the fourth time tonight. If you don't get ahead in the count, you can forget about having any success against him. Come on, kid. Get on for us. Here we go. On the ground, right side. Could be extra bases. Throw comes in quickly, holds that go-ahead run at third, and there's still one away. Two hits for him in this one. Both were extra bases. Got to feel good about that. He wasn't able to elevate it, but he put a great swing on it. Right on time, good, balanced approach, and just blasted it through the infield. A chance now to take the lead, and at this point in the game, that could be a deciding run. And the batter now, Nolan Jones. Base hit, one run is in. Oh, he throws it away. Oh, just a nice job coming through in a pretty high leverage spot right there. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. The ones in the cage, you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity, right on top of it. Now a huge at bat in this game coming up. Two on, one out. Here's the left fielder, Luis Medina. Yeah, we need you right here, one time. Next pitch misses way outside. You know, Boog, if you're that base runner at second base, you want to be quiet out there. Not bouncing around, not distracting okay. your teammate, the hitter. Make sure that he can clearly focus on that pitcher and that release point. Pickoff throw, and he's back he's in there. easily. That one missed. He's getting a little frustrated out there on the mound, getting hit around a little bit. Let's see if he can settle himself down. Yeah, one time, right now. The 3-1. Three 3-1, one. Three one, and he couldn't come up with it. A real bad time for a walk. You're trailing in this ball game, trying to keep things close. They've been in a difficult spot, and things aren't getting any easier. So bases loaded with one away. Here's Michael Tolia. But I think ultimately you want to tie him up, get the ball in on the plate so that he can't get the barrel to it and hit it to the outfield. Outside corner got him looking. He can't believe it. Now the catcher up to hit. Derek Kroger, one for two. In for a strike. Now it's three and two. The pitch. Ball four. He's walked in a run. He's really gotten himself into a mess out there and now forces home a run with the wall. The setting's definitely getting away from him. So two away with nobody on. And now the big time power threat, Steve Rogers. Singing, he's a guy that covers both sides of the plate about as well as anyone in the sport. How difficult is that to do? Well, I'll just look at the back of my bubblegum car. This one swung on and hit well. Way back there. And that one's gone. His 63rd home run of the season, and they add to their lead. It's 8 6. Singy, he's been red hot. Yeah, another big swing of the bat for him. Man, he is really seeing the ball well in this one. He came out of his shoes on that one, but managed to keep his mechanics intact long enough to get to the ball and through it, and it went a long way. So one out, nobody on. Stepping in, the slugging now shortstop, that. Steve Rogers. Jeez. He's already homered in this game. Roger. That's ripped. Base hit. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. 
went up there looking to be aggressive and got something he could handle. That's a good sound coming off the bat, man. Yeah, and as he connected out front baseman. and ripped it into the outfield, Nolan. that's one of those swings Jones. where you just don't even feel the ball hit the barrel. That's a pure stroke. Runner on at first with one gone. So now here's the Reds' cleanup hitter, Nolan Jones. Hey, let it rip. One time. Another throw over. Rogers leads off first with one away. Back to first. And once again, he's back in safely. And another move. And he's safe again. Uncle. Hey, need you right here. Need you. And the righty deals. Sliced hard, but foul. Hey, your pitch, your pitch, huh? That smash towards center. Franklin makes the catch. And there are two down. Not fooled at all right there. He was clearly all over it. Up but sometimes you hit it too hard no and right at it. someone. Louise. You're looking for one of those loop hits to get a knock right sometimes. Right Man at first. Now the left fielder, Luis Medina. Kicks and deals. Tried to check his swing there, appealed a third, and that's a swing according to umpire Mike Fillmore. The one, two. And there's a ball. You see how the catcher wanted that pitch up and in. Want to try to tie him up. That's the one thing we're seeing, that high fastball. You have to get it up there because of how hitters have changed their swings. And a foul ball left side. Check on the runner. Rogers back in on a dive. Let it rip right here. We need you. 2-2 two, two now. Rips that one to right. Makes the grab on the run. And that is that. Five, six, and seven will lead things off in the bottom of the night. Reds lead this one 13 to 6. He's two outs away. And at the plate for Miami, Roberto the Castillo. The third baseman. Roberto Castillo is a 1-1. Grab ball to first. Could be two. There's one. The double play ends it right here. Well, a real nice performance out of the pen. This guy is not the one who usually gets the final out, but extended his role a little bit and helped his team get the win. He got the save. Nice job. 13-6 the final score for Chris Singleton and our entire crew. I'm John Chambi saying so long.